you guys, now we got to get into the big Valentine's Day box mm -hmm. office because it's expected to be huge. Oh, yes. You know us ladies, well, we can't wait to spend Valentine's weekend with Mr. Gray. Michelle, like I think it's first in line. <laughs> I know you're going to be going too, though, Kev. Please, stand <laughs> over there silent. I'm not he saying a word. Like, right. Well, joining us now is Tara McNamara from Fandango.com to break down the numbers. Welcome, Tara. Hey, Tara. Hey, guys. Okay, I want to get right into this, Tara, because last year the winner at the Holiday Box Office was the Lego Movie. This is a little different <laughs> a little than bit. the Lego Movie, but I'm hearing that they can actually break that record. It made, what, $62 million last year? Is it going to make more Fifty Shades of Grey? Well, some estimates are putting it at $95 million wow. for an opening, but we at Fandango have talked to the studio, and that number looks more like 50 to $60 million. Um, and then, you know, no matter what, it's the highest-selling R-rated movie in Fandango history. All right, let's break it down geographically. Tara, what parts of the country are you seeing with the most ticket sales? Let me break out the 50 states of gray map huh. here. <laughs> and what's interesting is Mississippi has sold nearly four times the average tickets than anyone expected. Wow. Mm -hmm. What is happening in Mississippi? We see you, Mississippi. <laughs> Meanwhile, another movie you're excited to see this weekend? Kingsman, The Secret oh, Service. Yeah. It looks good. It's even better than you can imagine. Well, Terry, thank you very <laughs> much for being with us today. We appreciate the breaking down of the gray category. <laughs>